What's up guys, it's XBM Connect here. Now in this video, I'm gonna show you how to create a build using the um, Fire TV skin. Um, this is not compatible with the Hitcher's original official uh, Fire TV skin. This is actually a modded version of uh, Swal Fred's um, edition, ba basically Fred's edition of Fire TV skin with fully working and integrated live TV. And I'll have the downloadable link to, to Jarvis, to Krypton, uh, the, the skin versions and all that in his repository, and the whole thread about it so you could like uh, keep up on it and stuff. Uh, let's go ahead and, and download the repository. I'm gonna go to my add-ons. I am using the Krypton 17, so you can see. It's all from a zip and I did download it so let's just gonna go ahead and get this one Fred's repository once that's installed uh, go ahead and install his skin look and feel you could actually install the the sounds of it and the screensaver that uses the fire TV as well um, that's up to you that's really optional but it's recommended uh, let's go ahead in the skin skin obviously you can see that it's the FTV Fred edition Krypton and version 3.6.8 so there's a newest version after this video then it's primarily the same uh, it's just a little different with minor tweaks so let's go ahead and install it give it a, give that a few seconds this is actually my first time installing this so this is kinda fairly new to to the way um, the way things will look so just bear with me I'm gonna try to if it's too long of a video, then I'll cut it to a part two and all that stuff. So let's let let's that uh, download. Now, once this comes up with the Fred edition, go ahead and click yes, and it'll go to it. And would you like to keep this change? Yes. Now, it's looking pretty good right now. I mean, it feels like I'm, I'm on a Mac computer right now. And uh, let's go out of this real quick. <laughs> Obviously, it's building. Uh, the skin has no mouse support. is highly recommended to disable. Go ahead and should I do this? Go ahead and click yes. As it's recommended to disable, should I do this for you? Go ahead and click yes. <laughs> and oh wow! Oh, that's really good. So let's go dive into the uh, man. That's really good. Has the icons in these. Oh man, that's really good. Anyway, let's go ahead and go to settings and go to. Uh, there's no skin settings. Let's go to interface. Let's go to skin. Obviously, we're in the Fred Edition Krypton. And go ahead and configure skin. So, as you can see, you can customize a bunch of stuff preload on startup, um, enable YTV show icons, and all this other stuff too. So, I'll get. Let's look into a little bit of it. But right now I'm going to keep everything defaulted and then we're just going to go mess with the home menu. So the home menu, you could have the search channels and all that. Now we are going to take off, let's go ahead and delete weather, don't really need that. Let's go ahead and delete um, photos. And if you have music add-ons, keep it, but I'm going to go ahead and delete it. And keep videos so you can go to the add-ons obviously. And favorites, we're just gonna go put this down at the bottom of apps, and we're just gonna. That's actually for the live TV. So let's start off with the search, and um, let's choose a shortcut for it, which uh, I'll use. Um, let's go to video library, go to video add ons, and let's use Exodus. And let's use the search option on here. So let's use that search and create menu item to here. So basically, that's where it's going to land. And I don't know if it'll show widget, no nothing to turn that off. And that's about it. So for the channels one, which is the live TV section, um, which I'll show you that in a minute. And let's go ahead and config. It's looking like there's no sub menus, which is. A lot better I'm um, to the movie section uh, let's do the Zen movie section basically so we're gonna go uh, choose a shortcut and we're gonna go to video library and uh, video add-ons we're gonna use Zen 
and we're just going to use the movie section and we're going to create menu item to here so basically it uses that whole um, section of that option of the add-on so it goes straight to it so uh, under set widget content so let's go ahead and set one and we're going to go ahead and choose um, a shortcut and we're going to go to video library video add-ons and let's go to exodus and we go to the movie section and let's use people watching because that's basically what's always trending let's use that one now that's going to give a few seconds to scrape and create menu item to here is what you're going to choose and we're going to change the name of it to a different name so on here if you have a keyboard on a Mac it doesn't actually use use it because you're gonna have to use the backspace like if you're using the Fire TV remote which is kinda cool but I am on a Mac so it's a little different so I'm gonna press that one and we're just gonna type trending and then done um, I'm not sure if it's going to choose a different one, but we're going to go ahead and um, choose OK just to see it. And then at the bottom, just choose OK. So just we're just going to go and check it out. So now you got the search button. That's kind of cool, the, the icon of it. But we'll see if we can change that. The channels, this is obviously the live TV section which is pretty dope but it's a little sluggish because I think that there's a little too much happening uh, back out of it real quick and we're gonna go to the movie section obviously it's kind of a weird square looking right now and it gave me a little glitch so you it's loading uh, actually it goes to it so let's see if we could change the uh, option in, in the view section of the settings let's go to the interface let's go to skin and configure skin customize home menu that a few seconds and go to movies go to set widget and uh, see that says banner none Let's see if we can change that. Obviously, I can't choose anything. Set view for all. Can't really change that either. Ah, right here. Square type. Uh, square info. So let's go ahead and click out of that real quick. Square info. Let's see if we could change it. Uh, it just goes down. So click on square info and let's see if we can change anything. Obviously there's there's nothing. Ah, oh, damn, it came up. So it's a little sluggish, a little buggy. So um, let's do posters for TV show, movies, and sets. So that creates it um, looking again. So instead of that wide look. So let's go ahead and click OK. And then click OK. And let's go out again and just to see how it looks ah that's a lot better so now when you go to the right it'll, it'll show a different poster and all that let's see if we could actually uh, sh show another uh, content on here with the TV shows maybe adding like a little episodes and all that stuff so I'm gonna show you another way to do it so let's go customize home menu not sure if it's the Mac or uh, the skin that's kind of kind of buggy or slow so but it looks freaking phenomenal I mean it's just looking like if I had the um, fire TV on right now so let's go to the TV shows actually let's go ahead and add one so I can show you so we're gonna go add and it's at the bottom right here so let's bring it all the way up and bring that down and we're just gonna choose uh, a thing for it so enter title and we're gonna choose um, new episodes so 
Sorry for taking so long. And there. Eh, we'll just do that for now. Let's go ahead and click done. And we're going to choose the shortcut, obviously. And we're going to go to video library. Video add-on. And we're going to go to um, Exodus. And we're going to go to new episodes. That's what it goes to. Uh, when you click on it but not the widget part so right now it's actually scraping let that scrape for a little bit and create menu item to here so obviously that's where it's gonna go and the new episodes became a capital with the N and, and stuff so let's go ahead and turn on the widget and we're just gonna go um, widget group 1 and we're just gonna name this uh, new TV shows and then done so let's go ahead and click on it set widget content obviously we're gonna use um, the number two choose a shortcut obviously we're gonna go to um, video library video add-ons and let's go to uh, Zen maybe they have a new TV shows section it's TV shows and there is new TV shows and create menu item to here and we're gonna go ahead and change this to posters and we're gonna go ahead and click OK and then click OK again go out of this so that's the channels this is the movie section oh that's really cool um, even though you're just in this section right here but when you click on it um, that's pretty cool uh, when you click on the new episodes obviously it's gonna take you to the, the section right here which you could actually change the, the view option so let's see if we could change it to square poster uh, panel let's just go with the poster and done and Wow, that looks really good. Uh, let's uh, if we go to the left, and you can just fill it up with a bunch of stuff. Now let's see if we could actually change. Um, see, it's a little buggy to 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 me, but I'm pretty sure they'll they'll get a lot better. But this is an attempt. I mean, you could change the background. Let's see if we could change the background of it. Let's go to settings. And we're going to interface, skin, configure skin, customize home menu. And for the search, let's see if the search right here. So you could actually turn off the background if you want. Or uh, let's use this menu for the background. And then the movie section, obviously, turn off. And we'll just use, uh, is there a movie one? And we'll just use that. I mean, you could um, implement your own as well. Uh, let's go TV shows. And let's use, uh, let's use that one. So let's go ahead and click OK. Now it's built rewriting the menu skin. And then that's the search now. I mean, it goes to the uh, Exodus search or Zen. The movie section, obviously, TV shows, that's really dope. Um, hopefully this gets uh, better. I mean, right now it's really good. So make sure you guys uh, t test it out and, and uh, let me know what you guys think. Thank you for watching and please subscribe to our channel and like our videos. And follow us on Twitter at XBM Connect to keep up with the updates.